Hello, I'm Michael Wiegman. Welcome to Art. Today we're going to be creating a monochromatic painting, as you can see here. This monochromatic painting is a painting with one color. As you can see, I chose blue, and it's using all the different tones and tints and shades of that color to create and construct this painting. Now, as you may have guessed, choosing a reference image is important. Reference image meaning the image that you're going to base the artwork off of. I chose this image of Chicago skyline here, and then basically I threw Chicago above it. As you may also be able to guess, there isn't actually Chicago written in the sky above the city of Chicago, so you have to take some artist's um, liberties to create an image that you want rather than an image of the photograph. Because if people want a photograph, they'll probably take a photograph. If they want a painting, that's what you're going to provide. So to start, choose a color. It could be any color. I would suggest using colors like purple, red, blue, as you can see because I chose blue for mine. Um, orange works really actually pretty well. Um, browns are incredible. You can get this nice sepia tone feel to it. But colors I would stay away from are sometimes colors like pink and also yellow. First off, pink because it's really hard to create a pink color that's really dark because that just turns out to be red. And for yellow, it's just really hard to create a nice cool looking clean yellow that is also dark because otherwise it just looks like it's dirty yellow. You kind of got to change the way you think about a painting in order to create a successful monochromatic painting. Now watch as I basically construct the image before you. Basically step by step constructing each section of color as I move throughout the painting. Thanks for checking out this video. Let me know if you have any questions. Shoot me a message in the comments box below. And subscribe if you want to see more videos like this in the future. Have a great day.